call you right back. I'm sorry. Let go, drop it. <laughs> <laughs> What's good favorite squad if you guys are new to the channel, please make sure you guys like comment and subscribe right now to the channel guys I know we know it's been a little bit. It's always a little bit with us But don't we look fresher? Don't we look happier? Yeah, don't we just look like we are enjoying our life like off camera? I don't know. I don't know it may seem like that to me But I'm because I'm the one living it, but I don't know if you guys can see like a little bit like we don't we look, look Refreshed. Refreshed. Not drained. Yeah. So, but we've been having a couple things to deal with off camera, and we're going to talk about a couple things right now. And guys, I know we say this all the time, but you guys will see. We're uploading for the rest of the month. Just, the rest of the year. Just, just know, like, we're, we're officially back. We had a lot of things to handle, so then this is one of the things that we had to handle. So, babe, take it over. I'm gonna let babe Where take the I floor start? on this one. How do I start? Uh, we've been going live a lot lately, and uh, during our lives, we've been getting a lot of comments about where is your baby? Where is sushi? Yes. So, uh, babe, I'll let you explain where is sushi and what happened, or okay. how you want to do it. First, I think I'm gonna explain what happened before yeah. I tell you guys where she is. Okay. Rewind when we first got this place. Yeah. We read the lease agreement to this place, and I noticed it right away because I remember telling Charles, like, like, is this true? What are we gonna do? And this was after we signed the lease. Yeah. Like, we, we read the lease, but we didn't, like, I didn't, like, go through it. Through yeah. It. Like, does anyone go through it? Through it? You read the main parts, what you gotta owe, what you gotta do, all this stuff, but yeah. we didn't read the fine print. Yeah. So one day, I'm just looking through the lease on my email, just because, I don't know. And I see it says no pets, and I go to Charles and I'm like, it says no pets. And then we were just like, we're gonna keep it a secret. Like, yeah, no one's gonna know. Like, Sushi's a good dog. Like, she's not, like, she's not a dirty dog. So we were like, we're just gonna, like, not say anything yeah. <laughs> because we don't wanna get kicked out of here. And we just moved in. <laughs> We've been having a lot of problems since we moved in here with our washer and dryer. Yeah. Okay, um, and we can show you because we bought a washer and dryer because our washer and dryer is just not, it doesn't it's not work. doing it, its job. Yeah, it messed up a lot of our clothes yeah. and a lot of our things, which I know, like, this is like, I guess it's off topic, but it's not really off topic. No, but it, this is what, this is how it happened. Oh, okay. This so, is, like, this yeah. is what brought You're right, you're right, you're right, okay. you're right. So, our washer and dryer wasn't working. Mm -hmm. So, we contacted our landlord, and <laughs> every time we needed, listen, every time we needed the landlord to come in, I'd like take sushi to Brighton Jessica's house. Yeah. Because I didn't want him finding out, right? So, one time the landlord didn't come, his contractor came to mm. see what was up with the washer and dryer. And the contractor saw that there was like, Right by this door right here, there's like little marks where Sushi scratches because we leave out of that door and she doesn't like when we leave, she gets separation anxiety. Yeah. So she scratched off the paint and you can see like little paw prints, yeah. like where her like dirty paw prints on the door. And we clean that off regularly, but you could see the scratches. Yeah, like they're like a, like it was like deep. Because she just scratches at it because she yeah. gets anxiety. You know how like dogs buy at the bottom of doors? Yeah. It was one of those situations. Yeah, and but we were just gonna like, before we leave, we were just gonna like paint it, you know? Yeah. Like, take care of it before yeah. we leave. But the kind contractor had said something to the landlord because they are buddies and then the landlord had confronted us and like we're not gonna lie yeah I wasn't gonna lie so that's what happened we got in trouble one of the biggest things okay I'll say one of the biggest things about it was we knew this place was a strict place because oh. they already like we have obviously y'all know like we still have our old cars and we, we have new cars now and like our cars are at Brayton Jessica's house mm -hmm. like our other two cars are at Brayton Jessica's house we only have a two car garage yeah and they won't let you park in the back or they won't let you park in front of your place like the all these like houses are part of the homeowners association yeah so all of our neighbors like we didn't know this because we've never owned a house before yeah. like they're all really strict yeah um, and it's a lot of it's like a, a lot of older people we know this are the youngest people here yeah and we both got a parking ticket like parking stickers on our car to move like they're just really strict yeah they're they're definitely and i was honestly in the beginning because like the first week that we lived here i was walking sushi around the block and everyone was like oh you live at so-and-so's place our landlord's name yeah and i'm like dang like that's good they're gonna find out like <laughs> it, it was it was just so like yeah every, we were just always on the sh yeah we always have to be kind of sketch yeah and we ain't really like that, you know what I'm saying? We ain't really like the type to like hide stuff and like be all sketchy. We had to always kind of be sketchy. She had to walk sushi at night, which I didn't yeah. like. Like she never could really like walk her door. The neighbors the like match it. Like I, the neighbors are really nosy, so they're always wondering like, what you yeah. doing? What's your dog's name? Yeah, yeah. Your dog? yeah. Like, yeah. When did you poop last? Like that. Like those, they're like really in your business. So anyway, they noticed. Well, he noticed the scratches at the door, and then we got confronted. We told them, but Charles and I. We're like, what are we gonna do with yeah. sushi? 
the thought of giving her up was never a thought in my mind. I was yeah. like, no matter what, I'm never giving up this dog. Yeah. Like never, like this is my baby. It will never happen. Like mm -hmm. just talking about it, like I wanna cry. She's not going anywhere. Okay, so I was like, what are we gonna do? And we're thinking, okay, he has friends here, but none of his friends are like responsible enough yeah. or want a dog. Cause yeah. like having a dog, especially like like a dog like Sushi is a lot of responsibility. Like she's a high maintenance dog mm -hmm. and loves to be around people all the time. So we're like, we're not gonna like give her to any of your friends. Like Tanera has a child, like nobody around here could take her. You know, for like a short amount of time. Yeah, we were thinking about the uh, like a daycare. Oh, a but daycare. see, with the daycare, like we're not allowed to have dogs here, so she would still have to come, come back, back home. Yeah, throughout the night. It, it, she would actually have to like, because the landlord does not want animals here at all. Period. Yeah. Like no animals, like not even a squirrel uh, yeah. or like <laughs> a, rabbit. <laughs> a rabbit, like nothing. So we were like discussing our options, and my parents came to my mind because my dad's retired; he doesn't mm -hmm. work. And I was like, this is perfect because Sushi needs someone to be, be with her all day long. Yeah. Like she loves, you know, attention and to be around people. So we gave her to my parents mm -hmm. and they are taking care of her. So that's why we haven't been filming or uploading because that was uh, very emotional itself. Mm -hmm. Like just, it, even though it's like I'm giving sushi to my parents, I didn't want to. That's not their responsibility. Yeah. But until Charles and I figure out what we have to do here, we're trying to get out, okay? Yeah, we're so trying to get out of this place. I'll explain that part. Okay. So we have been talking to realtors. We have been literally looking at houses. I don't know if you guys watch us on Instagram, but we've been like looking at houses. We even talked about like different states to move in. Like we're kind of like over this place because of that main factor. Like we're just like, you know, if we can't have the dog then we honestly don't want to be here so we're kind of like looking for places to move i mean we're actively looking yeah and we signed a one-year lease here yeah. and we're looking but also like uh we put a lot of money down yeah. on this place so if we did break it we would be losing like a lot of money but we're tr we're trying to figure it out we're yeah. trying to figure it out with him and we also like want to find a place that's like similar um obviously that allows pets but like similar space and everything because we both have our own rooms mm -hmm. so that's what's going on but she's with my parents right now she's not staying there forever yeah as, as soon as we find a new spot or if we have to finish out this lease if it comes down to that hopefully it doesn't but if we do have to finish out this lease until november she'll be there till november but that's why we've been absent because we had to deal with that and then also i flew her there yeah so we came up with so many absences because like honestly like we thought like flying an animal was like such a ordeal so we were like trying to find friends to drive her i was like i don't know how well she's gonna do on a plane like sushi you know she's never traveled like that before so then charles was trying to find friends to drive her there and that wasn't working out and then finally we called the vet and we're like is there any way you can get a health certificate it was like it was it's a it big was ordeal a i'm not it gonna lie that, that was the biggest it was, thing it emotionally like it messed me up because yeah. i did not like you know you're going through the motions because you like have to do it because like you know like we have to live here you yeah. know we signed a year lease but like i'm going through the motions of i don't i didn't want her to go mm -hmm. okay, I'm gonna cry. i didn't want her to go so but, yeah. but I know she's in a good place. She's with my parents. I FaceTime her all the time. So we're good. Yeah. And, and honestly, her and my dad are like this. Like when he tells me stories about like what they do together and stuff, like they're literally like two peas in a pot. She's obsessed with him, which I already knew that. Like she was going to be obsessed with him because he's there all day, every day. Like, that, like that's, that's, that's her buddy. So um, I FaceTime her all the time. Um, I was just there not too long ago. I went to go visit her. Because mm -hmm. I, I dropped her off, came back, but then I was like, I gotta go see her again. Like, I missed her so much. So then went back, I saw her for a little while. So she's doing really good. She's good. Guys, I've been <laughs> the one behind the scenes trying to get us pretty much like a new spot. <laughs> like literally like I've been, I probably looked at like three houses by myself and then I looked at one house just recently with Alyssa. But I've been trying to like hold everything together, I'd say on the back end, trying to make sure that we can get out of here. And just, I always send her houses like every single day, like what, what do you think about this one? What do you think about this one? But we're kind of like in the process where like, how do I explain Like we're like in the process where we need to buy a house, right? Like not need to buy a house, but like we don't want to keep wasting money these these rents and now it's like okay 
We can't. We can't do we can't what we want to do. We, want now, we pay you know? to live here, but we can't even do what we want to do. Yeah. And I, it, it, it is partly our fault because, we, like, it, the lease said no pets. Like, yeah. why did we like move here? But honestly, like, it was after the fact that I saw the no pet. And like, even like when the realtor was showing us, he never like. Yeah, they said never. That. They never mentioned That's, like, like no pets. That's like their first thing they say. Like, hey, do you have animals? Or hey, do you, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, it was never. Yeah. And maybe because we're just so used to all our other places, we're so cool with pets. Yeah. And and also our neighbors have pets, but they own their house. Yeah. So that makes sense. But everything other than that has been good, but that's been the biggest thing. And that's honestly like, if you guys want to say like, oh, you guys should be filming. Like, honestly guys, like we had to make sure that we got our, our life together because that was like a big ordeal. That was like a week, two week project. No, that was, it was an ordeal. Emo it was like an emotional. Roller coaster for Alyssa <laughs> and me. And literally like, we couldn't just like, you know what I'm saying? And then we were also scared. I'm like, what are we going to tell you guys? We were scared about like the backlash. Yeah. We don't be as y'all know we like to put our information out there but at the same time we kind of like our private people i know that sounds crazy because we do youtube but like we are very private and we don't like you know we're gonna we don't gonna put all our information out there but i feel like people were asking on live and we, was like, we were like okay we gotta like say something because we don't want to just have people thinking like we did some weird shit. Like, like i don't want people thinking that we gave her away yeah, like no. she was just like we just know like i literally told charles like we talked about it we're not giving her away to yeah. a stranger no like nobody knows our dog like we know our dog yeah. i'm not giving her away to a stranger she's going to my parents i can take her back at any time mm -hmm. like no and they were very open about it like they my parents didn't care at all so all right guys well on that note let's go get some food guys yeah so i kind of didn't want to like have it all like sad and stuff so we're gonna go grab some food because um we're not sad i know but like i didn't want it to be like one of those things where we're just like sitting there crying no on so listen the reason why i was just crying was because like talking about it again makes me sad as soon as we figure everything out it'll be fine okay you guys so we're in the car so we're about to go eat at this spot it's called the breakfast club and they serve breakfast and lunch so i thought it'd be perfect for charles and i to go because he prefers breakfast i prefer lunch and it's still like it's like we're in the brunch hours right now ah! okay i don't like it i really i don't like it stop, stop, stop. oh you pinching me yeah because i don't like oh. that i really don't like going fast guys we went to go look at a house the other day and there was this like road it was like a straight road but it, it, it had those little bumps you know oh yeah. i thought i was on a freaking roller coaster i was like i was grabbing him I was like this and he's he's like he's with this this other McLaren was like next to him with a kid in the car and the kid was just like what yeah the kid was having the time of his life and I'm like this <laughs> like freaking out he looked like, like this that's he all the, he's something that's what all the people with these cars do all they do is honk at each other and smile and they go like other. this I've noticed a lot of this yeah they all do like they're this. all like Good Good job, job. Buddy. <laughs> I'm like, he just thumbs you up and he's like, yeah. Like, and then I started realizing it's like a thing, I guess. It's to like thumbs a, up. It's like a I'm thing. gonna I'm gonna start thumbsing up people in my car. To see what people do. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, so we don't know how the wind is gonna be blowing, but we're at the breakfast club right now. I'm still kinda weirded out how you wear your mask to the table and then you take it off and then everyone talks. <laughs> It's like, don't talk to me. I just want to know who made that rule up. No, you gotta wear the mask all the way through, even while you eat. So this is this is my mask, but the, the waiters have masks on, so that's good, perfect. Yeah, so I think I already know what I'm gonna get. I want to get the turkey club because it has avocado in it. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna get like some pancakes and eggs and some grits. All right guys, so these are the pancakes. They look extremely good. My over medium eggs with my toast. And I think that's Jam. strawberry jelly. And I got sweet potato fries, my wrap, and some ranch and ketchup. And it looks delicious. Doesn't mine look good? I'm gonna let you guys know how it actually tastes. Wait, take a bite of yours. You like it? It tastes really good. It's really fresh. Okay guys, so we just got home. Our washer and dryer just got delivered. Yeah, and I don't know. I think the people are here fixing it up. Yeah. Like putting it in, they're obviously. They're about to like plug. They are here. They're out front. They're about to plug it all up and everything so we can use it and actually wash our clean clothes. Clean our clothes without them getting ruined. Yeah, but um, we're still like on a hunt. So if you guys are, if you guys know any realtors out there who want to make some money and sell us a house, I'm saying quickly though. 
know what I'm saying? Let us know ASAP because we're kind of on a hunt and we need to get up out of here. We need to find something very soon. Yeah, uh, we we're, we're know for sure that we at least got three months here because just the way our like lease is set up, we at least want to do at least six at months least here. At least six. That way he doesn't tax us and try to move out. So we want to like get out of here in at least three to four three months. Three to four months, we're yeah. hoping. Yeah, but um, guys, we love you. Thank you guys for watching the video. Remember guys, we are back. We'll see you guys tomorrow with a new video. We love you guys so much. Thank you guys for rocking with us the entire time and supporting us. And thank you guys for hitting us up in the DMs. Guys, listen, I learned that if people are not contacting you, asking you where your video is at, that means they don't really care. So thank you guys so much for mm -hmm. just hitting us up, blowing us up, asking us why haven't we been Being posting. Concerned. Yes, we love you guys so much. Thank you. We'll see you guys next video. Adios. Yeah.